Hey there, Captain Whitebeard here, and welcome to Turnip Boy Commits Tax Evasion. Alright. Tax bill. You owe a ton of property tax for the for your greenhouse. You have until like yesterday to pay it. Failure to pay will give Mayor Onion the deed to your house. To load 143,753. Sincerely, the government. Oh, plus 50% interest. Fuck him. He can eat a bag of dicks. Oi, turnip boy, you really screwed yourself. What do you mean, what? You committed tax evasion. Yes, tax evasion is a real thing. Anyway, you owe me a lot of money, and you obviously have none, so consider yourself my personal assistant. First, head over to the bustling barn through Lair Lane. I'm trying to set up a town hall there. There's a bunch of animals I need someone to take care of. Bring me back a bag of fertilizer as proof, or you'll be sleeping with the rock. <coughs> um, oh, same thing as before. So he needs a bag of fertilizer. What do you want, kid? Listen. I'm getting ready to rob the rotten in this graveyard. I need complete focus. And you seem like the annoying type. Get out of my sight, kid. Okay. Ever since that freaking Mayor Onion took over, this town's been a mess. I mean, look at this path. It's obviously overgrown. Like, you'd need a heckin' sword to get through this mess. You hear you can get I hear you can get one in the weapon woods though. Hey, whoa! Woo! Have you met my little cat Apple Munchkins? Aren't they so oh woe? -oh. Actually, my little red munchkin ran away. If you could keep an eye out for it, that would be perfect. Mega meow. Micro meow. Alright. I have no items. Hello there, TB. Oh, these flowers? Yeah, I'm not really sure where they came from. But they're pretty nonetheless. Excuse me, Rutabaga Adolescent. Please step away from the premises. This is an IRS operation. We need to secure the area before you pass through here. We got our eyes on you. Okay. Hi! Yeah, I'm a blueberry. You're a turnip. Goodbye. Okay. Nice, I got a watering can. Hello, chap. Have you seen my watering can? My eyes aren't what they used to be. I haven't seen it for days. That watering can means so much to me. I really hope no one stole it. It's the only thing I have left from my old lady. Aw, that's so sad. I have a watering can. Here, get watered. Bye. Hey. And a flower. Neat. Thanks for growing that flower. Make sure to bring it over that special strawberry. I don't want any of the other folks getting the wrong idea. Okay. Uh, turnip boy? Thanks for the flower. I don't feel the way, same way. I'm sorry. It's not from you? Oh, thank the mushrooms. Flora sent this my way? How sweet of her. Do you think you can take this letter over to her for me? Dear Flores, thank you for the pretty flower. Would you like to go on a date? Someday we could even get married and pay our taxes together. Yeah, <laughs> get fucked. <laughs> Watch out for the snails. They're vegetarians. Uh oh. Bro, you ain't gonna believe this. Jerry has been crashing to my place for a week. He hasn't paid a cent of rent. 
We're on good terms, bro. But I don't speak much snail. I don't really know what to do about it, bro. Yeah, I don't know, homie. Oh, hey! Oh, heck. I lost the baby. I was told to babysit a little carrot. And I sat over... I sat over him with this stool, but he escaped my sight. Maybe this school, stool needs to sit on me. Either way, can you keep your eye holes peeled? I swear that's how that phrase goes. <laughs> One dollar reward. RIP! What's this? Hmm. Alright. Well, I guess I'll have to go this way. Soil sword patch. Hi, you turnip boy. Yeah, I've been traveling around the farmland and exploring the forest around it, and I found something cool. Up ahead is a rare Planticus sorticus. If you have a second, check it out. I uh, will do. Thirsty plant patch. Someone please water this boy. Nice! It's dangerous to grow alone. Take this. Nice! Now I can sword things. Let's see if I get any rupees. Does this game even use rupees? I honestly don't know. But, whatever. So far I don't see shit. Hmm. Uh, I guess I can't stab her. That's a shame. And we'll stab this dude. I'm looking to see if there's something hidden under these. So far, not so much. Just murdering snails. Like you do. What's up, dude? Got any spray paint? <laughs> I'm itching to vandalize public property, you feel? Dude, I do. Shit and masks. Neat. Okay, well. I wish I could rip up a sign. Nice! Cherry was going to pay his rent. Bro, why'd you kill Jerry? He was defenseless, why? Oh wait, he has rent money? Cool beans, haha. <laughs> Bro, uh, since he's uh, dead, take his, his check for the remainder. I need that cash. I wonder what he says now that I ripped that up. Bro, snails are weird, huh? I did buy some chips at that cash, though. They're pretty good, not gonna lie. Nice. Now I got a fucking soul. Oh, you delivered it? Sweet, thanks a lot. Take this as payment. Nice! I got a hat. Sweet. Uh, wow, there's kind of a lot of quests. Okay. Well, that was rude. <laughs> you need a haircut. Desperately. Oh. But who? 
The Great Edgar? Best barber in all of Veggieville. Am I kidding? Famous client of mine wants me, the Great Edgar, to dye their hair. But alas, I do not have the dye to do it. Obviously, this client is higher priority than your dumb hair. I urge you to come back another day. I hope you give me something I can rip up in front of you. Real estate agents sold me this studio apartment. They're smaller than most, and more expensive. I'm hoping the alleyway scenery pumps me full of creative juices. <laughs> oh, hi there. Are you looking to purchase some real estate? Oh, Turnip Boy. I'm sorry about that. I hope you get your greenhouse back soon. I've been so busy lately. Mayor Onion has been trying to raise property tax. It's been real hard to find new clients. <clears throat> Trust me. You don't want to go down this alley. There's some shady stuff down there. Trust me, boyo. Alright. Well, um, oh no! I'm stuck! Oh. No, it's just a controller glitch. That's fine. Okay, we're back. Alrighty. Welcome to, to Way Sandwich, home of the Tier 3 sub. Can I take your order? Oh, you don't want anything. Figures. Business has just been really slow. Wish I could get someone famous to eat our subs on, say, a live stream or something. That would really bring in the business. Hey, kiddo, this place is off limits for now. Come back later when you beat the game. Where's the boss man? I don't know what that means either. Okay. Oh, right. I should, uh... Oh. Hmm. Rip. Up one hiring exterminators to get rid of unwanted livestock. Ooh. Reward the players so they stay engaged. Hey, hello, turnip over here. I have short term memory loss. I'm just trying to get to Veggieville. Please tell me where I am. Oh thank you. I now know where I am. Coffee breaks. Am I right? Hey, kiddo. This is an active construction site. Scram. Why am I not working? I'm on break. Brother, I work here. See? Here's the documents that prove it. <laughs> well, kiddo, you outplayed me. <laughs> uh, that never gets old. Bustling barn. Sub gamer, I'm Mayor Onion's assistant, but you can call me by my gamer tag, Slay Queen Thirty Two. I'm the best forklift fighter. Or I'm the best for uh, fork fight player in Veggieville. I will tell you to check out my streams, but I haven't been able to get live since the pigs in here make so much noise. Oh, you want to get into the bustling barn? Well, I have some bad news. Access is exclusive to my true fans who give me tier 3 subs. Wouldn't be fair to let you in for free. Be sure to like and subscribe, though. For real, though, like and subscribe, please. <laughs> uh. <sighs> oh, it's you again. Wait, Slay Queen 32 wants a tier 3 sub? Here, it's on the house. Just make sure she eats it on live stream so I can get that clout. Yes. Okay. Aw, turnip boy. Thanks for the tier 3 sub. As a tier 3 sub, you gain access to the bustling bar, as well as my autograph. 
Here you go. Now, if only someone would do something about all those pigs making noise. I miss being able to actually stream. <laughs> you want to watch my stream? I would love to let you, but I haven't been able to... Oh, okay. Yeah, go kill the pigs, basically. I'm fine with that. Shrek shit. Water at twice your own risk. Ooh. Oh, water twice at your own risk. Nice. Okay. Um, yeah, I don't really get it. What if? Everything needs a key. Okay, well, whatever. We're gonna go in here. Uh, that's a worm. That's a dead worm. There we go. Hearts. Boom boots! Use these to kick blo uh, boom blooms. Run into them to send them flying. Nice. Okay. Boom blooms. Hey, turnip boy. I'm just taking a break after a pig kicked me in the roots. Nah, I'm okay. I just hope someone gets rid of those things soon. Anyway, I heard if you find some boom boots, you can use these to kick bloom bo uh, boom blooms. Yeah. Just let one grow and then run into it. Okay. Sick. Alright. What's up here? Oh, it's the mayor's office. Neat. How to do your taxes. <laughs> nice. Never gets old, man. I just want to rip up everything. Hope it doesn't get old for you guys. I'm having a blast. Okay. Oh, neat. This is down here. Okay. Sick. Okay. Well, that didn't work. Man, this place is a dump. I get why we need a town hall. Why do they pick the place overrun with wild or with gross animals? I can't figure out how to get through here. Then again, I hear a ton of blinks through the door, so I'm also not trying too hard. Yeah, get wrecked. Get wrecked. <laughs> nice. Time to wreck shit. Oh, finally. I knew they'd send the search party. The crew must have been worried. I've been stuck here for three days. No food, no water, no coffee breaks. Thank you, adventure. Be careful. There's a dangerous pig through this doorway. Oh, I'm careful. King pig. Ate a ton of fertilizer. Well, that's fucking gross. Oh.
<laughs> Get sorted in the nose. Fucking wrecked! Bro. Bacon. Nice. Heart fruit! This fruit gives you another heart. Nifty. Okay, okay. I fucking dig it, yeah. All right, let's get the fuck out of here. And a bag of fertilizer. It makes things grow like crazy. Why does Mare Onion want this? Field log number one. It seems that those who consume fertilizer display mysterious properties, such as rapid growth. Aw, uh, I can't rip it up. That's a shame. Well, whatever. Let's go give this to the asshole that kicked us out of our house for some reason. If it's a quest, it must be done. Thank you. Peace and quiet. Turnip boy, you did this? Thank you. For your efforts, I crown you Slay King 32. Nice, I got a crown. Yeah, I'm gonna rock the fuck out of that. Yeah, buddy. Thank you for delivering it. Since you helped me in my business, the least I can do is help you. Here's a copy of Fastbook so you can figure out your taxes. Nah. Well, I'm not surprised. Thanks, anyway. <laughs> oh, hey, this is open now. Uh, I should take the fertilizer to the king. Or mayor. Whatever the fuck he is. I'm glad those animals are out of the picture. This fertilizer will come in handy too. Alright, so your next task as my assistant is to get me a four-pronged sphere. In ancient times, it was known as a fort. Assistants don't ask questions. The word of the grapevine is that there's one in the forsaken farmhouse that's supposedly south of here. I've heard horror stories about a bunch of moldy sweets in that place. You're in no place to complain. Go get my fork. Go fork yourself. Instead, I'm going to go this way. Hey dude, Scram, you don't know me. I mean, I don't know you. Hasn't your mother ever told you not to talk to strangers? That's true. Check this out though. Fucking metal, right? Aw, oh, shit! I got another heart. Yeah, coming over this way was definitely the right idea. Do I water these? Nah, I guess not. Well, whatever. So we got another heart. Oh, okay, he's still getting ready to go in there. Yeah, whatever. Uh... Rocky Ramp. We like to learn new dances and post them on Flip Flop. Sometimes I'll do even do karate or karaoke. I don't know why I said karate. Hi there, I'm a teacher from a nearby patch. Nice to meet you. I would love to stop and talk, but I have to attend my class. I'm on a field trip right now. This place is pretty cool. There's this interesting cave I want to have the kids check out later. I accidentally dabbed in front into uh, Holly's phone while we were recording for Flip Flop and fell off the cliff. Oops. 
This is the worst day ever. I dropped my phone down the cliff. I have no idea what to do. Well, uh, I guess you'll just have to get fucked. Bork, pets. Bork, bork. All tangerine dogs will cease to exist when the game is beaten. Whatever that means. Oh, okay. Well, I'll have to keep that in mind. Why, how do you do there, Venture? Yeah, I'm doing pretty darn fine myself, if you ask me. Just here, watching these lovely snails. I'm the local snail watcher, as you must know. These are an endangered species. Us veggies and fruits gotta make sure we don't destroy their ecosystem. We should be coexisting. <laughs> That's adorable. Turnip boy. Working on that debt, huh? You should have really been on top of that. I'm always running around. Always on my A game, you know? You'll get there. Anyway, you can't go this way. We've got important business to conduct. <sighs> the IRS just being dickbags. What a surprise. Hmm. Rip. Field log number two. Little is known about how many fish are in the pond, but it seems we can only observe one at a time. Hmm. Wrecked. Why? How do you, oh. Oh, it's just talking about the same stuff. I thought he was gonna be like, why? <laughs> All right. Welcome, newcomer, to the carrot patch. Yeah, we live pretty far from town. It's scary to go over there, so we just vibe here, just swaying back and forth as one does. Don't worry, we're safe here. There was this weird thing that came here, but I took care of it. What do you mean, how? I chucked it in the trash. Did you see the weird orange thing? Yeah, there was a small orange thing that came here. Kind of look like us. It is really small. Weird, right? I agree. If something looks like you but small, you should definitely throw it in the trash. I bet the view from this deck would be amazing. Too bad the stairs are broken. Maybe we could use a stool to get up there. Do you like my specifically placed box collection? They're totally not here to keep you in the level or anything. That would be wacky. <laughs> That's fucking random. Lost baby carrot. Their babysitter must be looking for this lad. Oh, we found the carrot. What the fuck is up with this weird JoJo reference? It's like the most vague of JoJo references. This game is fucking weird. Um, okay, let's go this way. Actually, I'm gonna go ahead and bring the uh, baby carrot back to the carrot mo uh, babysitter. All tangerine dogs will cease to exist after we beat the game. All right, so I can't go through there until those stupid fucking IRS moves. All right. Oops, I walked right the fuck into that. All snails must die. I killed Jerry. Ha! <laughs> Yo, you found him. Thank you so much. Take my stool. It's like literally the only thing I own. He can't get away this time. So if he's on my head. Can be used to climb onto decks. All right. I think this method of babysitting is working. Good. Don't lose him again, loser. <laughs> The soundtrack is pretty dope. Definitely has the uh, weird, wacky video game vibes that I dig. Okay.
fish. That's a cute looking stool you got there. Yeah, I just remembered that I'm terrified of heights. So you go on ahead. Aww. Sad for you. Forsaken farmhouse. Dear Diary, Mom and Dad grounded me for breaking the front window. But Matt was the one who did it. I ain't no snitch, but I wish you fessed up. Respectable. Remember this life lesson, kids. Don't be a snitch. But if you're not a snitch, you know, you'll just have to uh, deal with the consequences of not being a snitch. Face mask, stay six feet away. <laughs> uh. Okay. Baller. Well, that was weird. Dear Diary, I went to Matt's baseball game today. It was weird since everyone was wearing masks and we sat far from all the other families. Matt hit a ton of home runs though. Oh shit! Ooh. Yeah, that was a little bit spooky. Oops. Well, that wasn't what I meant to do. Uh, oh, yeah, that didn't work either. Hmm. Oh. Old Joe says they're part of Did you really destroy our fortifications? Well, you better be willing to help us cover the costs. Go over yonder to the mission board. Some folks got work that needs doing. Don't look so down. It's the least you can do. Take this key. You should be able to use it to explore the farmhouse some more and get some work done. Be careful, there's rot in the foot. If you wanted to be a real doll, you could start up that generator. Hiya, turnip boy. Didn't expect to see you here. I decided to urban explore this abandoned farmhouse. It used to be inhabited by, what are they called? Who-mans? This specific room is called an icebox. I've been conversing with the residents, and I guess they've been here for quite some time. Something about the cold extending their lifespan seems like some type of conspiracy. But if that's the case, I wonder if they could ever leave. Attention! Drop and give me 20 for your crimes! That door took two years to fortify, Cadet! How could a rookie like you blow it up? That was amazing. You must be some type of super turnip to break through our defenses. Can I have your autograph? No. Alright. Supplies needed. We need medical supplies. There's been reports of these in the house. Go get them. Talk to Nurse Barry. Global warming. Our camp is warming up. We think it's because the generator is down. Help! Talk to Camp Leader Dad. Missing child. Round, red, black, soulless eyes. Says help a lot. Talk to Carly and Sherry. All right. Well, first off, we. <gasps> Ooh, shit. Yeah. Yeah, that was a. Uh... Yo, spooky. Yo, spooky, spooky. Medicine. Okay. Oh, well, we managed to explore a little bit more. Uh, all right. We needed to check over here. Me. Huh. Man, I don't fucking get it. Weird. Oh, 
Oh, okay, that time that actually worked. Okay. Band aid! Sick. Ooh. Yeah, we're gonna want that heart. Okay, so we can't really go over there. Uh. Okay. Did we get everything? Yeah, we got all the supplies for the nurse. Let's see, is the nurse in here? No. Nurse up here? No. And there's a lot here. Yeah, I think we'll take a look at the rest of this in the next episode. Take a look. Yeah, we're pretty far in. Okay. Well, anyway, I do believe that's about all the time we got for this episode. If you enjoyed it, be sure to share it with a friend because word of mouth does help small channels like mine grow. And leave me a comment letting me know what you thought. I think Turnip Boy seems like it's going to be pretty funny, if a little bit random, but you know, I'm fine with that. But yeah, I'll see you in the next one. Have a great night. Peace out.